everyone, Joel Hansen. Today we're in Fostoria, Ohio, outside One Bull, the One Bull Cereal Bar guys, who are doing the One Bull Cereal Challenge. Now I have had hundreds, literally hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of you send me this challenge. This is a pretty much undefeated challenge that went absolutely viral. So this is a giant cereal bowl challenge. So it is to eat the One Bull, the One Bull to rule them all, which is consisting of five boxes, yes, five whole boxes of cereal. It is served with a gallon of milk. You don't have to finish the milk, but you have to finish all the cereal. You have 25 minutes to complete the challenge. But what's awesome about this is there's actually a $300, yes, $300 cash jackpot on this challenge. You do pay for the challenge regardless. Um, it is $25 if you use normal milk. If you use almond, lactose-free, coconut milk, etc., it is $35. I'm going with almond milk today, so it's going to be $35 regardless. Um, but yeah, it's going to be a lot of cereal, five different boxes. Um, I will definitely pick some of my favorites. That is something you get to do. You get to pick the uh, boxes of cereal. Previously, they had like a spin wheel. You did not get to pick them. It was kind of more random, but you get to pick them. So that's not too bad. Uh, but I'm definitely going with, go with, gonna go with like Lucky Charms, maybe some uh, Fruity Pebbles, um, probably like maybe Cheerios. And I'll think of something else. I'll get you the flavors here just momentarily. But yeah, let's head on in. Let's have some of these food. And uh, that's about that, guys. So $300 cash jackpot, hopefully for some cereal. So at that, let's go eat. Real quick, I want to thank sponsors of this video being Keeps. Yes, Keeps, helping men keep their hair. So what is Keeps? Well, Keeps is an online subscription service providing doctor-recommended hair loss treatments to help you keep this stuff on your head. They offer 24-7 care and support using their team of experts to prescribe you, advise you, and make your hair goals a reality. So with Keeps, you can get a homegrown hair treatment plan without ever having to enter a doctor's office or a pharmacy, as all the plans are not only doctor recommended, but they're actually sent straight to your door. And that's at like half the cost of actually going to the pharmacy. You can also easily subscribe to the service, so you'll Keeps will keep sending you everything you need, and so you'll never run out of these hair loss products. So with that, everybody, be preventative with your hair, not just reactive, because hair loss stops with Keeps. So to get 50% off your first order today, go to keeps.com forward slash Joel Hansen or click the link down below. And yes, that is K E E P S dot com forward slash Joel Hansen. And with that, let's get to the rest of the video. All right, Ron, so here we are with the one bowl, definitely a very, very large bowl. So again, I had to pick the five flavors. We have five flavors. So I went with Cocoa Pe or uh, Fruity Pebbles on the bottom. I got two times Lucky Charms, although they didn't use the real Lucky Charms, they used like the fake Lucky Charms, so I think they're gonna be a little different. I got one times a cinnamon toast crunch. I got one times of a plain Cheerio. And in that plain Cheerio, they were short a couple. So they put a few of the French toast crunch for me as well. So that's about that. 25 minutes. Again, this challenge has been completed once by uh, Mr. Nathan, our friend Nathan. Um, but yeah, that's about it. It definitely smells good. It's a lot of cereal, five whole boxes. Um, but at that, we're gonna start here just momentarily. So uh, time starts officially when I start pouring the milk on it. Again, we got little little mouths on the almond milk, so I'm gonna try to squirt it in as much as possible. And depending how this goes, I may have to stand. So if I do, I'll just probably adjust it as we go. I don't know what makes more sense ergonomically. Um, but at that, everybody, how about we get started? Let's say at the count of five, four, three, two, and one, let's go. Okay, all about in the pot. Let's get this on the go. Definitely start eating. It tastes good. I mean, the first bites, how can you wrong with cereal, right? Sugary cereal? Alright, it's at least all wet, so. Hey everyone, welcome to this video. Today we are here in Fostoria at the One Bowl Cereal Bar, taking on the One Bowl Cereal Challenge. So, 
definitely a very big bowl of cereal. I will start by saying though, you guys have sent me this hundreds and hundreds of times. You have tagged me in the post. You have sent me these messages on Instagram, on Facebook, and I do get them. I really do get the messages. So thank you all for sending them. Um, I was aware of this challenge for a very long time, and it was definitely on my radar. As soon as I was kind of available to get in the area, give it a shot at winning that cash jackpot, which maxes and was sitting at three hundred dollars. <laughs> Just for a minute, half in, tastes good. So the rules of the challenge are pretty straightforward. Um, the actual serving size of this like bowl, what comprises this one bowl is five of their hungry bowls. So again, it's a cereal bar, so you can order like a small bowl of cereal, a medium bowl of cereal, a large bowl of cereal. And the biggest size is called the hungry bowl. So it is about a five cup serving of cereal. And then this, again, one bowl is five of those. It is served with the gallon of milk. You do not have to finish it all. So hypothetically, you could actually eat the cereal dry. Um, but you know, nonetheless, basically just eat the cereal in the 25 minute time limit and you're walking away with that cash prize. Again, you're paying for the cereal regardless, but I think it's very reasonable. Um, and you do need a 24 hours notice to try this challenge. So for this challenge, there have been hundreds of attempts, just literally hundreds. They were saying how the wall of shame is far, far, far from what it should be. It just you know, hasn't been kept up because there have been so many attempts. This challenge went very like viral. It became very, very popular um, just kind of across social media. There's been lots of news coverage of it. And you know, definitely it became very well known in kind of that food realm and especially in the area. Um, people within kind of this Fostoria area, which is kind of like Findlay, kind of uh, Bowling Green area, they were all very familiar with this cereal challenge as well. I do like cereal. And it does taste very, very good. I don't eat fruity cereals often. So my strategy for this challenge was essentially just wet it enough like that it was easy to eat and then just kind of hit it hard and go from there. I wanted to put the fruity pebbles on the bottom thinking that that would be like the last flavor I got to, but really the way the cereal floats and mixes, it was getting, I was getting every cereal with every bite the whole ride, um, you know, despite being, you know, so, you know, few, few fruity pebbles compared to the rest of the cereal. Um, so definitely, you know, pick your cereals expecting that they will fully be mixed and there will be, you know, the, that cereal in every bite. Now, when it comes to the actual difficulty of this challenge, I will say it is an expert level food challenge. It is an expert level food challenge or at least a very high intermediate. Um, the time limit, in my opinion, is actually quite reasonable. It, and, and, and honestly, I don't think, you know, the fact that you'd be eating potentially soggy cereal adds to any difficulty. I think you're just eating what you're eating. The difficulty is the capacity and volume in one's stomach, which they have to have to do this. So it's a lot of cereal, but it's also, like I said, a lot of liquid. Like I had to pour the three liters into this to basically have it moist enough that I could really eat it effectively. I maybe could have gotten away with a little less at this point, because you see I have a little bit of float, but really my cereal is not arguably floating in the liquid. <laughs> About five and a half minutes in, guys. Very, very good. I'll have to shake it up. Ooh. 
So long story short, if you cannot consume a gallon of liquid and a couple pounds of cereal in a short period of time, you, there is just no way you're going to complete this challenge. That being said, if you want to give it a try, you know where to go. I never recommend actually uh, eating this much cereal in one sitting, but if you are in the area, stop on by and grab yourself a bowl. I was also impressed how quickly I felt the effects of this cereal. Within like five minutes, my stomach was cramping and I could tell like my sugar levels were really, really, really rising. Um, like really, like it's crazy how quickly it affected me. Feels a little weird in the gut. But that's all the info I have for you today, guys. So let me know your favorite cereal down below. Yes, your favorite cereal down below. My favorite childhood cereal is Lucky Charms, I think. Well, I don't know. There's a lot of good ones. I like a lot of other ones, too. Cinnamon Toast Crunch is good. Fruity Pebbles are good. Um, anyway, let me know your favorite cereal down below. And uh, at that, let's get to the rest of the video. So the milk is not required. I will need to shoot most of it anyway. Whew. A lot of cereal, guys. I feel my stomach like cramping up or something. We are, I don't know, eight and a half minutes or so. Let's probably just drink this and finish it up. Wow, that is sugary right there. Is that done? No. All right, and we are done. Stop. Uh, so we're about nine minutes, 20 seconds or so. Definitely a very, very big bowl of cereal. There's definitely the one bowl to rule them all. <coughs> Excuse me. Who gets some air out of there? That's for sure. Woo. But, um, yeah, guys, huge thanks to everybody here at One Bowl. So for that, I guess we have 300 bucks, pretty cool. Things are definitely a very, very large bowl of cereal. Um, but thank you all. I was made aware of it, like I said, by literally hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of you guys. So thank you for the support. Thank you for always letting me know what is up. Appreciate it. Hope that camera has been focused. I don't know if it's focused on my face or not. Anyway, yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed it. Um, like I said, a heck of a challenge. Definitely, there's been over 100 attempts, over 100 failures. One winner previous are good for Nathan, and I think the time was 20, 24 minutes and 57 seconds or something like that, like very close to the time limit. Um, but yeah, guys, so with that, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy it. I think maybe we get a t-shirt, do a t-shirt as well for winning? This is yours. We also get a t-shirt for winning. It says, one bowl, the cereal bar, and on the back it says, I did it. I guess we did it, guys. So yeah, like I said guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Till next time, of course, if you have the hunger, happy eating. Don't eat five boxes of cereal in one sitting by any means, especially sugary cereals. That's a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. But uh, I guess we got a liter of almond milk for fun. And uh, that's about that, guys. So till next time. Foster, Ohio, surrounding area, our South Toledo. With that, have a lovely day.
Hey, guess what? You rock, yes, you rock. Thank you so much for watching the video. I totally appreciate it. I hope you left me a comment down below. I'd love to read them. I hope you also liked that video. Hey, by the way, click my face. You can subscribe. Yes, subscribe. That way you always get my uploads. You won't miss me when I'm in your town. And I also picked two videos for you. Yes, two videos I know you'll love right here. So watch one of those, hit my face. And with that, thank you so much. You rock.